Kyle Sloter received an enormous opportunity on Thursday night. The undrafted rookie out of Northern Colorado started Denver's fourth and final preseason game against Arizona, playing all four quarters. With Paxton Lynch injured and Trevor Simeon resting, Sloter was Denver's only option at quarterback. It was a rocky start as Sloter surrendered a safety and an unnecessary sack early on, but it didn't take long for him to get into a rhythm and move the Broncos' offense. With Sloter at the helm, the Denver offense finished with 322 total yards, 19 first downs, and accounted for 23 of the team's 30 points. Sloter completed 65.2% of his passes for 220 yards and a touchdown, with a QB rating north of 100 yet again. His QB rating through four preseason appearances is a combined 125.4, with three touchdowns, 413 passing yards, and zero interceptions. If this kid was a mid-round pick, there would be no talk of whether or not he makes the Broncos' 53-man roster, but the team has no investment in him other than time. That doesn't mean, however, they're willing to risk him to the waiver wire. The fact is, Denver needs a backup quarterback with Paxton Lynch on the mend for at least a couple weeks. Kyle Sloter might not be a viable candidate to stick for all 16 games, but the Broncos would be remiss at this point to ignore the rookie's contributions and look for a failsafe elsewhere. The kid has earned a spot on the Broncos' 53-man roster, even if it is short-term. For Mile High Huddle, I'm Chad Jensen.